morning guys welcome to today we are racing to the barn to give storm his medicine i have his antibiotics here um if you guys are wondering what we do this is his it doesn't look like much it looks like less than normal but anyway this is his antibiotic we add water and put it in this big huge syringe and then we syringe it into him because the dude will not eat them people are at the barn already going on trail rides and we are not riding our horse because he's got a sore leg but actually we've been approved I can actually walk him yeah we've been approved to get on him walking the swelling's good he just has a cut and so we're having to keep uh the cut scraped a bit so what? that we don't get any proud flesh in there and that Mom, makes it take forever you know to heal how much seconds um race car driver scrubbed it how and how hard how hard till it started bleeding like crazy yeah and how two long? seconds not that hard yeah yeah not very it's hard so i just like feel me. bad that it happened right they're gonna go and do that i'm gonna show you what we're dealing with in ontario Canada. so that is it you guys we either have a skating rink or a pond that's what we're dealing with. That's a pond right now. It's all slush and mud. I didn't know I got this squishy yesterday and I love it. It's so squishy. You should go get one. And it smells really good too. But anyway, today it's a different day than normal for us. We are going to come back tonight. Ride Storm because Gabby's dying to ride him. Riding sometimes is not about riding. It's about connection. It's about being together and supporting one another and her getting him moving and taking him to do something fun so uh we're gonna do that today we're gonna you guys might not know that gabby rode estella the other day there's a video on her channel uh like 11,000 of you guys have already seen it but i don't know if anybody else wants to see it we are starting to get her back into work our arena we're still working on that Sam's tractor is not starting so yeah there's always a, a battle but we will get there um and so we have a plan for bringing her back into work now. She's going to practice framing on Stella at a walk for days and days and days. They're just going to work together slow and steady and hopefully it works out. Then we're going to progress and um, yeah, so you guys are here for the journey of bringing Stella back into work. If you guys want to hate, just keep it with you. Just keep it. Yeah. Okay? Don't say it because... Here's gotta hate. Lovers gotta love. Yeah. We are lovers, you guys. We are lovers. We do not want to hate. But if you gotta hate, you just gotta try and suck it back in. That's what Sophia's saying. Basically, we are picking up Kaylee at her house and we're a little lost. So thank goodness for cell phones. I'm gonna message her and say that we're lost. So on the other side of these houses. Never take directions from us. Gabby is like a man when it comes to those houses where you can't go. Gabby's like a man. Oh, it's on that street. I don't know. All the houses in this subdivision look the same. That's the problem. Thank goodness this is not a huge subdivision because we found it. Sam got us here. Okay, say hi, Kaylee, to the day fam. Hi. We got Kaylee. Gabby wearing the same outfit. Yeah, Gabby's wearing the same outfit. She loved that outfit a lot. And um, I, had no other I did not do laundry the last couple of days, so she's wearing the same pants, but that's okay. Um, I only rode enough. All right, you guys. We yeah, we did. Yeah. Uh, where are we headed? They all look the same. Chloe and Molly. Yes, yes. they are going to get the... It's Molly's squad. birthday and Azzy's birthday. Pony Squad back together again. much I wanted to like show you guys the pony squad back together again but it's weird like before this was our barn this is where our horses were and this is where we took lessons so we could kind of video but just to go to somebody's personal private house now and just whip out your camera it doesn't seem very polite so I didn't do that but when we come back I'll ask them if they want to say hi to you guys um, but anyway, Sam and I, so we're dropping our girls off. They all got together and they did a big hug and it's so beautiful. Sam and I now have the whole day to do exactly what we want. Wait till you see what we're gonna do. Right, you guys, do you know where we are? Do you guys remember where we are? Comment below, where are we? Um, all right, now I'm gonna tell you we are at our old house because believe it or not, we still have some stuff to get rid of. So, Essentially, we have this shed 
and the garage. A few things were frozen in there so we couldn't get them out and the house is finally rented now. Oh my gosh. And so, yeah, this is disgusting. Whoa, and I see. Do you know what that is though? That is our little puppy stroller, our chihuahua stroller. But actually, Sam, you did a pretty good job. Yeah, you guys tuning in, um, I actually had a broken pelvis when we moved house. Oh. So I wasn't able to, oh, ice. So I wasn't able to uh, help move out, but now I can, darn it, and I don't want to. I liked it much better. I just laid in the chair and watched, watched videos on my phone and Sam moved everything. But anyway, now I'm gonna help and we're gonna get this stuff done. Right, you guys. What adults do when the kids are gone, we go out for lunch. Have you ever had an East Coast donair? That's where we are. We're in the Love. East Coast. We went to the East Coast while the kids were at a, at a This donair play date. shop is from the East Coast. The owners are from the East Coast, and I know them personally because they used to go with me here all the time <laughs> when I was younger. Meaning eight years ago. <laughs> eight years ago. <laughs> Anyways, they make the best donairs anywhere. So we're going to show you guys. Let's go. So look at Sam. He's getting so much thinner. He's trying to get me to get a double extra large. And I was like, no, we'll go for the medium. And it's got all these vegetables and spicy meat, tomatoes. You good? What makes it so good is this white sauce that's in there. It's like this yummy sweet sauce and it's amazing. That was such a good lunch. Now we're gonna go and do some shopping, some kid-free shopping. Um, uh, but before we go, I wanted to tell you guys that um, you know how YouTube is struggling with their comment section and they're in the process of eliminating the comments on family channels. So that is in the near future for us, I think, I suspect, I hope not. But just in case that does happen, I wanted to tell you guys that we are posting all of our videos on Facebook now. So um, if we do lose comments and you want to comment, you'll be able to go onto Facebook and comment there and tell us what you guys think. And um, we value you guys so much. Like posting a video without any feedback or without you guys getting the chance to talk with you guys is not like, it's not fun for us. So make sure you go and like um, our Facebook page. Sam has been posting um, bonus videos on Facebook as well. Um, little clips and things that you guys don't get to see in the vlog because we have so many extra things. And he's like, where should I put this? So he's been putting them on Facebook if you guys want to um, check in and see those little videos too. Last night he posted a video of Storm and Gabby and it was really cute. Sam wants to buy TVs for the girls' room. Wouldn't that be awesome to surprise them with that? Oh, that's not a smart TV though. Oh, we need smart TVs. So we're in Best Buy because um, we need a new camera. Like, we don't need one right now, but we're getting to the point. Like, these cameras last us about a year. Every day vlogging, the dust from the arena takes a toll on our cameras. So um, we always shoot with a Canon G7X. And the reason that we do is because it's really good in low light. All the other cameras, even though some of them have good things to offer, none of them have that low light thing that we need. Like this. So this is what we had when we first started vlogging, and the quality and wasn't... I love it. This one is good. Here. This is a good one. So... Sony Alpha. So other vloggers, I've watched videos where this they've tried amazing. new cameras and always switched back to this. I'd like to see how this it works. A good one. If you can get the stupid thing, you can't. So here, here it is. Uh, in the past, we've never been able to get this camera at the store. So many parts break on it, though, and it's almost a thousand dollars. Unless that, that's probably the last one they have because it's yeah, on sale. <laughs> We're trying. We found this other camera. It's a Canon as well. It's the EOS M series. And M100, it is. Yeah, it looks like it might be good for us. Good, better full. Full sensor too. That's full cool Try it on. So we're gonna try it. We're gonna put our memory Switching card cameras. in this camera, and uh, we're gonna video. So this is Sam with our camera. Mush and water. Uh, it 
is almost one o'clock and just like good horsey parents. Is it snowing? Yeah. We are here just in time to feed our horses because we love them. I love like no matter where we are, nothing feels better than coming home to our babies. Hi, sweet girl. See, I, see, that's a, oh, it's snowing out. So that's what I don't get. Like we've been feeding them outside now. Hi, sweet girl. That's my lunch on there. Oh, Willow, why you always got to be so mean to her? Stella is, hey, be not, you are such a sassy girl. Um, anyways, as soon as they eat their, their food, they come running in here. They, they don't want to be out there when the weather's yucky. You're such a cute girl. Oh, uh, let's see what's it like out here. Come on, girls. Come on. It's gorgeous out here. The ground is colder, harder out here, though. What? It's gorgeous out. It's not snowing out here. Oh. Hey. Come on. Yeah. So, bad news about our cat, about the cat, Fiona's cat, is that he got up there. Somehow, Sam let him get he up ate there. He food last night, though. Yeah, so last night we put out his food and he did come down and eat it, but he's a friendly cat. He doesn't just like hide up there, so normally he would come to us. Like, Gabby climbed up there last night and we haven't got him down yet, but Sam can hear him. So yeah, like I'm worried about him being up there in case he tries to jump down and get outside. I don't know, but anyway. Put the ladder there for him to come down. And see yeah. Hi Willow. It's kind of nice getting to have a chance to be with the horses without the girls here. Um, some of you guys, I don't know if I said that, but you've been rolling. You guys need a good brush. Um, Gabby's going to ride Stella today, hopefully. The ground is kind of hard though. Uh, oh, Willow. You have to be nice. Like, this is not treats. It's because she thinks I have treats, I betcha. Lunchtime, right? It's lunchtime. But they're not starving. I could tell when they're hungry, they come running to the door. Today, they're just standing there. And they heard us coming. Oh, she's licking me. Oh, that was not a lick. What the heck? Okay, that was not a bite, you guys. Don't freak out and say she has bad ground manners. Stella. Poor Stella. Whoa! Did you guys see that? Oh, my gosh. She needs a attitude adjustment. Stella, you need to tell her. She just kicked Stella. She just tried to kick Stella. Okay. I never wanted like ground covered in hay, but that's what we got. Why does Emma stay here now? Like Sam is like, let's go do some more stuff. And I'm like, no, let's just stay. Let's just stay and hang out with our ponies. Willow, I can't believe you are the boss of Stella. I can't believe it. Stella, do you have no self-respect? You're a big, beautiful girl. Stand up for yourself. Okay, so this is the worst winter ever. <laughs> Sam has fallen on the ice two times. Oh my gosh, it's terrible. He opened the truck door, got out in the middle of our driveway, and just <laughs> fell. But he, he fell like in slow motion. He just kind of did, did a circle and then just slowly landed on the ground. And I'm like, are you okay? Are you okay? And he's like, ow, 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 ow. And then it took him five minutes to get out. It's terrible. Like, I'm afraid to walk anywhere. I've, like, so many people I know have fallen and broken their legs this week. Oh, just since Monday. <laughs> oh, when I laugh, it's because I'm nervous. Not because I'm like, ha, 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 he fell. I'm like, oh, my God. Anyway, yeah, so poor Sam's been falling. Pray for Sam. Pray for us, you guys, to make it through the thaw. Because everything is so slippery right now. All right, we're here at the barn to address... Storm's wound again, and it's hailing out. There's ice pellets bombarding us. So Gabby's going to go get Storm. While I get the water, and the brush, and the iodine, and the dressing, and put the medicine in his food, because at night I put it in the food. In the morning, because he did, if we get here after he eats, I'll give him the little syringe thing just to change it up a bit too. So he's not expecting it all the time. Good 
grabbing it. Good boy. Or else. So we are done with the storm, but uh, it is, if you can hear that, it's hailing outside. So we just changed his bandage and we don't want it to get wet. So we're going to take our time here and wait till they put grain in his stall. Give him a little bit of exercise because now he's uh, been cleared to start moving now. Uh, only clear to walk. <laughs> I don't know without. Is that a freak out or what? I don't know. Anyways, only allowed to walk right now with Gabby on top and uh, get him moving around. I want my food, but it's not ready yet. Storm, so you gotta go back in the field till supper time. You guys we had a family emergency so I had to disappear for a little bit and take care of baby Jack and wow that was something because it is hours later and we have horses and we need to go and feed them oh we're stressing out uh, the problem is, is that our house from where they live is really far so we couldn't just drive back and forth back and forth otherwise it would just been bad but anyway we're headed home to see our horses we're an hour late I hope they didn't jump the fence I should say that I'm really glad that we give our horses lunch because the fact that they ate not that long ago um, really helps. But I hate her like, Mom. thank goodness we give them three meals a day instead of oh, just two. Please. Be careful. Oh my God. How many times do we have to Don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.